Hey, what's up, Ella? It's your girlfriend. Hello, what's up, Ella? It's your partner. We are back with another amazing tutorial on how to tie a headband on how to I think I should have done this with one of my wigs because my it would really look dumb with hair down and everything nice. Man, I think that is what you should have done. But either whole, we're still rocking this hairstyle. Oh, today it's bigger. My puff is bigger. Have you noticed? Have you noticed? Let me just compare. Today we are ooh, everywhere, everywhere with my African hair. But well, and girl, let's do this because I got you covered. And please, please like this video. Just it's liking, it's just tapping the like like that. Nothing much. It is nothing much. You know what else? Just that. Please like this video. Share me out. Tell someone about this channel. You'll be like, you know what? I checked this girl out and she was telling her, Bandana, fold in a bandana into her head, but she had so many tutorials. For so imagine telling someone like that. Hey, we tried. Just try it, just try it. And also subscribe, it is free and you can support me via the description. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and check out the description for support. And a comment is always welcome. And for those who DM me, <laughs> thank you. Anyways, uh, what do you need? We need you to like this video. It is on how to fold a bandana into a headband. It, I'm going to show you a very, I don't know if we should do two styles. I'll just focus on one and then next time you can check out my other uploads that is after super way. But I'll give you the best today. And uh let's just get into it. So you have a bandana like this. Make sure that you have somewhere you can place it if you're not able to do it in the air. But if you can actually just do it in the air well and good because it's, it's cool. But if you want perfection, because of this one, this one you can actually even Kwanza means first of all. And I'm teaching you these things. That's why you're here. <laughs> First of all, you can always like um, iron it, yeah, to make it smooth and everything nice. Anyway, not when starting. That is after we have folded it. Okay, so let's do this. Loving you. Which song is that? Hold up. Let's just get into it. <laughs> So have your bandana like this. <laughs> On a flat surface like here. Like here. Like that. And then you turn it like this. And then you drop it. You drop it. Like that. Make sure that every that tip is getting to the other tip down here. Like that. Have you seen that? have a bandana like this you're picking this side and vertical is it horizontal taking it to the other side and then having something like this it forms a samosa a samosa is a snack in my country samosa look for them sa the spelling is s a m o s a samosa in my native language, Kabisa, exactly, is the <laughs> Buddha. Yeah, weird. But it is samosa. So it forms like a samosa. And they usually sweet. It is like a coating of uh, chapati like. And it's cooked with the flour. And then on inside, you can put maybe potatoes. Or you can put inside meat. Or you can put uh, what you call green grams. That is dengue green grams uh you can put in cabbage pre-cooked and then you dip it into into oil you deep fry you dip into oil and then oh ah, there's some places they're sold at 200 shillings one other places they're just five shillings that is less than a dollar and uh other places like two dollars and above or one dollar and above just depends a little bit so that the value of something depends on the way it is and because you're here remember you're very valuable to me and i appreciate you appreciate you so much if you're a returning subscriber if it's your first time here so let's continue after forming the samosa like this 
I wanted to learn your words. Oh my goodness. Like that. The next thing you need is to fold something. Fold it again. All the way down. You can fold it all the way down or not. But in this case, we're going to fold it all the way down. Up to the edge. And then we have something like that. This other side, it is something like that. Okay. So, uh, what we do is fold it again the second time. And you see the side that in which I've done that, it is this side whereby this edge is touching this place. That is the place that I have folded a second time to form our headband. You see, it's already forming. Mm -hmm. Like that. There's two ways in which you can do this, but this is uh, much, much easier. That's why I'm showing it to you. So it looks like this. Like that. So what do you do? The side that is like this is the one that you would place on top. Like that. Oof, it looks amazing. So from the back, you just do some notes. And, uh, and make sure that it's not too tight. We don't want you have it. Lot bulgy, so uh, twice like that. So now we have something like that. You can uh, you can choose if you had a head like my wig, I would push it like this, up to somewhere at the center. If I had hairs, yeah, but unfortunately, unfortunately, I have to represent my country nation. So you can place it there at the center. Okay, simply like that. Let him some hair to do. Sorry, seems like I'm coming out of the camera. So what I mean is, well, it's here. You can push it just a little bit to where you want, up to that point, and then fold it. Hold tight the knot at the back. This is how to tie a bandana into a headband. And then you see it's representing your hair. Well, 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 well. well. But uh, for me, in my case, depending on my medulla and everything nice about me today, <laughs> you're going to place it right here on the forehead and then tie the knots. It's two knots, so that it's tight enough. And then, oh my goodness, I just look amazing. So next time I'll put the mirror at the side because it's making me get a little bit kind of so so like that. Hmm? If you don't like placing it on your hair forehead, just the way I showed you, you can showed you you can actually pull it behind a little bit. So there you go from the side. Cheers, take a picture. Yeah. That is it. It's so easy. Told you, remember, I have so many tutorials, so make sure you check out my other uploads. And uh, subscribe so that you don't miss out on any, any amazing tutorial. Remember, you are of value to me. I just told you that. Eh? So I think it looks good. I love it. I love the old school. So either way, okay, this is a matter to note. If you have lots of hair, you can place the hair inside. And then tie it on top or just let the hair fall down. And most of the time, if you let the hair just fall out. You see, mine is not all the way falling, but it's just out there. But it looks good. It looks amazing. I know it can look amazing too. So just do that, okay? And make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. When you give me that thumbs up, it actually supports my channel a lot, okay? And I appreciate that. It also encourages me to make more amazing content for you to teach you new words. Hmm? To welcome you into my community, imagine all that, a whole package. Anyway, that is it. I hope you're having a lovely time. See you on the next update. Niha, Lily, let me see if I pull it. I have so many. I'll show you another way to tie the headband. Uh, so make sure that you check out my other uploads. So make sure you subscribe to that. I think. 
be able to do that too. So this one is one of the easiest to use. Say cheese, take a picture. You're very calm, Miss Senorita. What did you do? Okay.